Hey guys, welcome back to another day in the life vlog. I'm getting this vlog started this afternoon. I just filmed a Dollar Tree haul video. So by the time you are watching this, it is, it's been a while. That Dollar Tree haul video will have already been up. So I'll leave the link to that video in the description box below. If you love a Dollar Tree, I would definitely check this video out. If you love like school supplies, planner supplies, crafting supplies, definitely check that video out. I am already in need to refill my water bottle. Uh, this water bottle from Walmart, I don't know how many ounces it is. I think it's uh, like almost 40 because it holds two of these and I think a little bit more. So I am in need of a refill trying to get my water in. I sat down to edit for a little bit, but I am on an editing break. I am currently editing um the lemonade photo shoot that we did so i'm trying to get caught up on editing all of my vlogs so i'm gonna spend a little bit more time on this and then probably pick back up on it a little bit later tonight okay i have the baby down for a nap so i'm gonna plan for a little bit and i wanted to share one of the sticker books that i have been obsessed with um i got the the greatest hits and it's like these ginormous like happy planner it's probably hard to see these ginormous happy planner sticker books and this one's called all in a season it comes with 100 sticker sheets and over 3200 stickers y'all this sticker book is absolutely amazing if you are obsessed with stickers you need this in your life if you're new to stickers you need this in your life so it has all of the seasons in here and you get multiple pages i think you get double pages of each um of each page let's see i don't think not on all of them but on most of them uh oh like on these like little sidebars you get double of each which that's always so nice to have but what's even better is, let me show you. I want to get my weekly spread done before baby girl wakes up. But here is like for Valentine's Day or for February. So you get these full size sticker boxes and then you get another sheet. I love that about this book. And then for like the little deco stickers, you also get doubles. So we did another photo shoot for the baby. We did a spa day and a photo shoot with baby girl. What was that like? Almost two weeks ago. And I was like going to vlog that day um, I did vlog like her little setup and like during like the photo shoot I did vlog some of that. I um, I didn't end up vlogging that entire day. I did vlog like little clips of the little setup for the photo shoot and like her like all dressed up and it was so cute. I just wanted to enjoy the day but I did want to capture some of that to be able to share with you guys and for Olivia to look back on and see me do the most oh my goodness it was so cute and it was so much fun but i did want to share that with you now so the next few clips are going to be her little spa day and i think it was absolutely adorable so enjoy the next few clips this is the next photo shoot and today's photo shoot is going to be a little like beauty salon spa day. I think this is absolutely adorable. I ordered this little hat off of Etsy. It is a little preemie sized hair salon cap. I think it's absolutely adorable. Okay, so let me show you the little overview of the setup that I have going on here. Y'all, it is just so stinking cute. Okay, so this little Melissa and Doug set is from Target. And it's a little wooden beauty salon play set. And I think it's absolutely adorable. It came with everything here, except this is her bow. These are the little Dollar Tree foam rollers. And then these little glasses are from Carter's. But the little set is absolutely adorable. Like, look at the little flat iron. <gasps> so stinking cute and the little hairspray bottle like you can like press it down oh, i'm obsessed so that's really cute and then here is like the little menu of the spa services that she can be getting today so i love that and then we have her boppy here this is like the perfect little thing to like help her sit up these little house shoes right here they're actually little doll house shoes from 
uh, Hobby Lobby. But, oh, these little uh, crocheted cucumber slices. They also came with the little hat. And let's see, these next two items are DIYs from the Dollar Tree. This is a Dollar Tree like clear salad bowl. And we just hot glued it to this little doll stand from Hobby Lobby. And then back here we have her little baby robe. And um, it is on a little plunger from the Dollar Tree. And then we added two little sticks and we painted it. So it's like a little coat rack. Y'all, I am so obsessed with the way all of this stuff turned out. I cannot wait to plop her down and get her pictures going. This little hat right here, we've already put it on her. It's adorable. I y'all enjoyed those little clips that I captured of her little spa day it was just so much fun her little like curlers were just the cutest thing ever I hope you guys enjoyed that if you did let me know in the comments down below before I start writing my planner I wanted to try these markers out to see if I could use them in my planner I don't know if they're going to bleed or like how well they're going to write and these are from the Dollar Tree they're by the Jot brand so let's see, get pink, purple, blue, and green. Let's go ahead and try them out. This is the brush portion. Ooh, I don't have fancy handwriting. But I definitely like that. Let's try the fine tip. Ooh, I like, I like these. Let's see if they bleed. No, they didn't bleed through. Wow. Okay, let's go ahead and just test out all the colors. There's pink, purple, blue, and green. Alrighty, I definitely think for a buck, these are worth a try. We just got a delivery. Let's see. Olivia and Bianca, I love you both very much. Eek. Oh my goodness. Whoa. These look amazing. There's two rows of them. Ooh. For mama and baby. And some birthday cake popcorn. Yummy, yummy. Thank you, Marky. I think I'm gonna go for this one right here. So good. Okay, so we just had a little treat I shared with mom and Meg. I'm gonna put the rest in the fridge, but these were so yummy. Miss Olivia is going for a walk to check the mail. Mom and Meg just got here with a Trader Joe's haul. Yes, please. Oh my goodness, it's been a while. I sent, th I sent them my list and I cannot wait to dig into all of this, but Meg's gonna go ahead and wipe it down for me and then I'm gonna do a Trader Joe's haul for you guys. Okay guys, let's go ahead and get 
started with the Trader Joe's haul portion of this video. Right here we have some fat-free crumbled feta. I want to make some salads. We got lots of dips. So right here we have the spinach and kale Greek yogurt dip. Dill pickle hummus. Oh my goodness, that's going to be good with some cucumbers. This is the organic creamy cashew fiesta dip. It's dairy free. It says it's a cheese dip alternative. I've heard that it's really good, so we're going to get that a whirl. Oh my goodness, I've heard this is amazing. The buffalo style chicken dip. So we're going to try this out. This is an all time favorite. It's the everything but the bagel. The Greek style yogurt dip. So I got two of these. I tried getting two of almost everything. Now that we have our outside fridge and we don't get to go to Trader Joe's very often, I thought it would be good for us to stock up and then it's good for you know us to have for the family. So we have some chicken spring rolls. Yummy, yummy. The Trader Joe's fried rice. A big bag of kale. Right here we have the chicken chow mein. And then, of course, we had to get the orange chicken. So good. The beef and broccoli. I haven't ever tried the Trader Joe's beef and broccoli. So all of these are just going to be like really quick dinners that we can have throughout the week. Over here, we have the fruit and vegetable wash. Let's see. It's not focusing. Focus. Okay, here we go. The fruit and vegetable wash. Here we have the sweet chili sauce. This is for the spring rolls and it looks amazing. I haven't tried the Trader Joe's version. We have some Trader Joe's salsa. We have some stir fry sauce. Put this over some grilled chicken. We have some Trader Joe's super bread. Had to get more of the fruit leather buttons. Y'all, these are so, so good. So more strawberry mango, mango and grape mango. Right here we have some Power Crunch bars, the sweet potato ribbons. These are super easy to saute up, add them with eggs or chicken. We have a cucumber. Okay, the chili onion crunch. We got two of those. I have heard amazing things about this, so I'm really excited to give that a try. Everything but the bagel nut duo these little salads are new to us i saw them on an instagram account and they looked amazing so i had meg get one for me mom and meg to give those a try okay these are new to us the stuffed gnocchi it's potato gnocchi stuffed with tomato sauce and mozzarella so these are new to us so we're gonna give those a try right here we have some chocolate chip brownie mix some candied pecans. This is going to go on the salad with feta and watermelon. It's kind of like a little Panera dupe that they had a couple of years ago. Loved that salad, so we're going to recreate it. Here we have the Pita Bite crackers. These are my favorite Trader Joe's crackers. These crackers are so good with about any dip. Okay, we also got a bag of tortilla chips and the popcorn in a pickle. We've tried this before and it is... A fan it. fave. Alrighty, so here is a look at our Trader Joe's haul. I am so excited that Livy's Cuddle and Kind dolls are here. My mom and I had been wanting to get one for her for so long, but the ones that we wanted have been out of stock. We finally got the email because we had like signed up to be notified when the dolls would come back in stock. We finally got the email and we jumped on it so fast and the dolls are finally here. So when you purchase one doll, it equals 10 meals and we love that about this company. All of the dolls are handcrafted. So if you look right here, it says one doll equals 10 meals. They're so beautiful. Oh my goodness, I am just so excited about this. Look how beautiful the packaging is. So we did one order. Um, my mom got her two dolls, one from my mom and then one from my dad so one from Paul and one from Gigi and then I wanted to get her one as well so there's three little dolls in here oh my goodness oh, they're beautiful oh my goodness okay so I'm gonna put the camera down I'm gonna open all of them and then I will share them with you guys 
y'all we opened them up and i literally could cry i just remember wanting to get one for her when she was in the nicu and then being out of stock and just seeing them here and having my baby home it's just so sweet and so special so this is ella the unicorn and this doll is from my mom and livy is her little unicorn because olivia is one of a kind and then this is Violet the Fawn, and this is the one from my dad's. So this is from Olivia's Paul. He loves deer, so this is the one he wanted to get her. She's so beautiful. And then this is the one that I picked for her, and this is Charlotte the Dog. I think she's so adorable. I love her little flower crown. Oh my goodness, y'all. Like, the detail on them. They're beautiful. I literally can see my baby girl just running around the house with her little dolls. And, you know, we will tell her, like, that these are the names that, um, you know, came with the dolls. But if she wants to change their name, she totally can. And when you purchased one, I believe you got, like, a free print. So since we purchased three of them, we got three free prints. And they are beautiful. And they definitely go with her nursery. So we're going to order some frames to hang these up in the nursery and this one is charlotte the dog and she says with grace in her heart and flowers in her hair <gasps> oh i just love it and here is ella the unicorn let your light shine oh for my precious girl and here is violet the fawn adventure awaits Oh my goodness. If you have been thinking about getting one of these for your precious baby, they do have a ton of other dolls on their site. Let me show you right here a few of them. They also come in larger sizes. So these are the smaller ones, and they do have the larger size of each one. Like the mermaid one is very, very cute too, if you guys can see that. They're adorable. Y'all, when Max sees these... He is going to want them. Max absolutely loves little stuffed animals, little ears like this. Oh my goodness. Definitely going to have to watch him.